Hey guys, Sean Delaney with Maximum One Realty. I want to let you know what a home is about to go on the market over in Dallas, uh, Georgia, 105 Amber Creek Way. Yeah, it's in Paulding County. This is a uh, home built in 2018 by Deer Horton, so relatively new in a cul-de-sac. Has a uh, two-car garage, level driveway space. It's kind of give you a quick tour of the uh, cul-de-sac there. It's maintenance-free siding with the vinyl siding in the brick front. So transom over the front door. As you walk in, you've got your formal dining flex space. Um, this, they were using it as like an office in home office area, but could be a dining space. Let's change out the light. It's your uh, double windows. And then that's your entrance for you space. It has uh, hardwood vinyl floors throughout. So it's vinyl floors that look like hardwood. It has espresso cabinets, granite counters, stainless appliances. You could like little breakfast bar area here. Um, your full walk-in pantry space. And then a nice open concept, big island, gas range, and espresso cabinets, uh, granite counters, your breakfast eating kitchen area, opening again into the uh, family room with a corner, corner gas fireplace. Uh, this has a chandelier in it that you could move to the uh, flex space if you wanted to use it in there. Put the in here. Your backyard has a back deck, a little bit of a backyard. So just a nice open space. It's got a good size uh, closet right there under the steps, around the thermostat. And then one nice feature is off the main here, you have a full bathroom and a bedroom. So if you had a mother-in-law team living with you, uh, great space, but this is also a great space working from home, right? So it uh, doesn't have to be a bedroom, um, but you could put like a fold out in there and make it a guest bedroom slash office. Have a uh, two car garage. It's got an opener. And again, this house was built in 2018, so it's practically new. Um, has two inch blinds throughout. It's moving ready. So you walk upstairs. This doesn't have a basement, this one's on a slab, but this one has something that's pretty cool is you have a finished loft space up here. So this is like having a finished basement space area right here. So they had a pool table in here, but you could use it for um, in-home schooling, you know, teen hangout area, what have you. And then the uh, secondary bedroom wing is over there. And the master suite is split on the other side. So it just gives you that extra separation. Has your Craftsman style shy and doors. Lots of windows. This is your sitting space. And then your formal, uh, uh, I'm sorry, your, your master bedroom owner suite. Lots of windows. So just a big space. It's a nice owner's bedroom suite. It has uh, two walk-in closets. Then into your uh, bathroom space, you got double vanity, garden tub, nice big four foot shower, separate room for the toilet. Again, this house is uh, like 3209 in square feet, so good size home. It was built in 2018, so everything is newer. Again, you have your split bedroom uh, over here, so the bedrooms, guest bedrooms on the other side. We'll call this one bedroom number three, because remember we had bedroom number one on the main. This is your systems, mechanicals, like your furnace and stuff like that, air handler. This is your bathroom number three. It has a double vanity, tub shower combo in the back. Call this one bedroom number four. And all the big, but secondary bedrooms are a good size. Let's get your closet over there. We'll call this one bedroom number five. Well, it looks to be the biggest uh, secondary bedroom. It actually has a double door. So this could be a good office too if you didn't need all these bedrooms. Um, closet there. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this tour, but this house is about to go on the market, looking to sell it quick. So come take a look or let me know and we'll get you in right away.